Hello again. We're back after a long, long break. It's unbelievable that I can still remember how any of this works. Well, here we have our Pi board connected to the PC. It's on slash dev slash TTYACM0. Here we have six pins wired to the debouncing hardware board and to some PCBs which will later be mounted in the guitar with switches. So we have six switches, six pins. We've also got on the board uh, VCC and ground because these are pull down switches. Okay, now the software. The software is, the test software is DVH6. That means debouncing hardware with six buttons. Here's the code, that's all there is. Here we have a screen opened to uh, slash dev slash TTY ACM0. We're going to run the init routine. It's done. Now we're going to run the loop. Okay, so the loop now is just sitting around waiting for interrupts. And we have six switches here, and you'll have to just trust me that I'm pushing different switches. So let's try. A switch which one we don't know oh that was switch five again switch five no bouncing let's try switch four which is very close this could bounce but it doesn't I'm pushing one at a time and I'm getting one at a time counts which is what I want now try another switch switch three looks good one at a time switch two Very good. Now let's try switch one. Very good. And switch zero. It looks very, very good. That was all very, very good. Okay, boys and girls, that's it for our test. And then we also see how cleverly this exits if I just do a control C, see that control C, which is an interrupt, keyboard interrupt. Up, oh, it realizes the test has ended and it says goodbye. How does this work? Well, we have find the callback. It just increments the flag vector for whatever line was involved. Initialization is just creating the interrupt callback routine connections. Then we have a loop which it wow, it just keeps on looping. And if things are true, if the flag vector is superior than zero, do the flag of that. Otherwise, increment i, and then increment i. OK, so if there's a keyboard interrupt, we accept. Now, what is do flag? Yeah, that's what it looks like. Flag vector of the index equals one, that means we just print out the thing and flag vector index equals zero. There we go, we increment. There we go, and that's all there is to it. Thank you.